Hello guys! Welcome back to Horse Club Adventures! And my name is Hootie Code and I'm looking forward to today's episode because last time we ended with this quest, something's wrong, but we are going back to the horses. So obviously we are not investigating it yet, but I really want to. Like, look how shady! What are they doing over there? Looking a little shady and... But anyway, you guys, how are you? Let me know in the comments below what you are doing this week. And I am looking forward to the weekend. We are so close to it anyway. Hey, okay, we're gonna speak to Sarah again. That's what I thought. That I... That it can only be Mr. Michaels. Did you see the way he looked around? He wasn't just talking a taking a walk. No? It's sure thing he's planning a construction project again. It's already late today, but at any rate, we should discuss this with the girls tomorrow. I want to go over to the sheep a little while longer. We will see each other early tomorrow morning at Lakeside. See you then. So obviously we gotta sleep through this episode. Or in this episode. Not through this. Duh. But yeah. Let's head back to Lakeside. Deliver the key and sleep and begin a new day. Alrighty, we are back at Lakeside. Let's speak to Mrs. Jacobs about this. Okay, talk. So, were you able to find anything at Old Anton's? <gasps> a key! Now that's interesting. I asked myself which lock it might fit into. Ah, seeing it. Seeing as how you brought the key now, it occurs to me that I found a marking that looks like a key on one of the stones at the Ring of Stones. I have asked myself what this marking is supposed to mean. I do believe there is a problem. Well, <laughs> I do believe there is probably a connection with this key here. Go take a look again there yourself. Maybe you will detect more on the stone that I have. Well. We will save that a little bit because I really want to continue uh, this main quest right now. Alrighty, and we obviously got a new reward as well. <laughs> Mr. Neil could really use our help today because his sheep broke out. They spooked when Mrs. Michaels drove by much too fast in his car. It's a sure thing he's planning a construction project again. Hmm, we have got to prevent it. Yeah, I kind of come to that conclusion too. <laughs> and then we have the loading in the morning screen! Sarah wants to meet me this morning at Lakeside. We have to find out more about Mr. Michael's plans. Yes. Maybe Sarah also found out something about the necklace we discovered. Yeah, the necklace! I forgot that! The <laughs> necklace we discovered yesterday in the woods. Woohoo! It's getting more exciting! Before I talk to him, I'm gonna actually groom Star so we'll be all ready. So give me a minute, I will be right back. Alrighty, let's talk to Hannah then. Oh, good morning, Susie. Sarah was already here early. I'm supposed to tell you from her that she's meeting you at the Glade from yesterday. Oh, and she also asked me if Ruby can come along with you. It's a uh, sure thing Ruby will be glad about the adventure. You'll we'll find her in the doghouse at the Of course! Okay, glad to... Can we get going? Yeah, sure. Then off we go! Whoever gets there first! Oh no, a race again? Well, this is a very cozy stable area, I must say. Like, what? Here's a little bigger stable and they seems to be able to live inside and all. Okay, we gotta get that from our horse to continue the quest here. Okay, hello Hannah again. Ruby, Sarah needs your help. Sissy knows where Sarah is, will you follow her? <laughs> woof woof, okay. <laughs> Aha, smart girl, that was a very cute picture of that dog though. Ruby's going to follow you now, see you later, have fun! Hey cutie! Oh look at her, <laughs> she's actually quite cute. Alrighty, let's continue, Ruby. We need to help Sarah. Oh, she was flying for a bit. Okie dokie, here we have Sarah. Hello, Sarah. Hey, Sissy, great that you're here. And you brought Ruby along too, thanks. Remember the chain we found yesterday? I think it once had a pendant to go with it. 
I wanted to I wanted you to bring Ruby so that she can look for it with her super duper sniffer. Here Ruby, take a sniff. Off the chain. Ah, that's the cutest picture, oh my gosh. I think she's already on the scent of a trail. Follow Ruby, please dismount. Okay. We will dismount. Ruby's already on the scent of a trail. Yeah, you said it just now. <laughs> Like, Ruby's such a cute dog, but she's not as cute as my dog. Like, ooh! That's pretty! Hello, Ruby! Oh, we need- we're gonna find more stuff? Yeah, obviously. What is that exactly? Locket lid collected, aha! Talk to Sarah! Ruby really does have an amazing nose. I love it. Hmm, a young woman and a horse can be seen in the pictures. I ask myself, who is it? Maybe Mr. O'Neill's knows more? We will just ask him. Okay, we will ask him. Uh, okay, Ruby, you go on then. <laughs> it's just disappeared over there. Hello, hello, Mr. O'Neill. We need your help. Hello, Sarah and Susie. Nice to you. nice of you to stop by, but luckily all my sheep are here today. We wanted to ask if maybe you recognize the girl in the photo. We found the locket in the woods. Say that's Natsu. Um, I mean Granny. I thought it must be ages old. Granny, thanks! I always forget that Granny has a name. Of course, it's just one we never use. Actually, it's a shame. Natsu... Natsu? It's such a pretty name. Come on, Susie, I know a beautiful route to the mill. Holy macaroni, that was a long ride. Luckily, I didn't record all that because that was a very detour, to be honest. Oh, oh look at this lovely lady. Hello, hello. Hello, Sarah. How nice that you have come to pay me a visit. Hello Granny, this is Susie. We found a locket and wanted to ask if you might be the girl in the picture. Mr. O'Neill thought it had to be your locket. That really is my locket! Oh, look how lovely it is! I lost it at some point and losing... No, nope. losing some and long since forgotten it by now, thanks to both of you. You're very welcome. Okie doke, let's see. And I'm very happy to meet you, Susie. You can just call me Granny. Those are lovely photos in the locket. Thank you, Sarah, but now about something else. I have heard rumors in Hazelwood about Plant Hotel. Your girls have to please keep an eye on Mr. Michaels. Oh, that will be terrible! We're going to find out what Mr. Michaels plans. That's a promise. Perfect, just what I wanted to hear, but now I don't want to keep you any longer. Your girls surely have something else planned for today. That's true. Come on, Susie. We still wanted to meet up with the others at the cafe. Bye, Granny! Alright, you guys. We are actually out of time, so we need to end this video here at the lovely Cups and Saddles Cafe. That mysterious locket. We found an uh, answer to that as well, because that was a thing we found in the previous episode. So I was curious about that too, but I wish we kind of keep track of Mr. Michaels first, maybe, and then the locket. But getting answered with the locket, pretty good. So you guys, tell me, have you played this beautiful game? Have you actually explored around? Thank you so much for watching. If you like this video, give me a thumbs up, share it with friends and family, and also subscribe to my channel for more videos from different video games. And I see you already on Sunday for more Hogwarts Legacy.